Hello there, everyone. It's Dan Talk here with Slick Start Gaming, and welcome back to another episode of Yakuza Zero. Well, as you know, this game was was streamed on Twitch, so uh, we're just gonna have to do that little screen transition to get into whatever the gameplay for this episode is gonna be. We have 58 points? Holy shit! <laughs> Any speaking of money drop items, I like- we're, Considering we've been doing that a lot now, we're gonna go ahead and get that. Dash without getting tired. I don't even know- What is dash- What are they calling dashing? Has there been a run button this whole time that I just don't know about? There's no- Wait. There's no controls editing? Okay, I don't know what it means by dashing. Because I don't- I don't run out of energy running around, so I'm not really- I don't understand that. Golden pistol. And we just spent all the points on the office stuff. So we get the money faster. Yay. Alright, and then I wanted to go go to Vincent. So I want to see if that exclamation point is that guy with the money, or if it was something else. Hey! Worked hard for the money. Throw away a total of 5 million yen. Alright, they're supposed to drop items now. Uh, nice. Okay. All the way up there. Alright, you guys want to drop anything for me? Yeah, you are. Come on, give me another item. That's not the entrance. Okay. Yeah, this is the guy with the money. Okay. Oh, I forgot he's a friend. Will he let me give money again? Probably not. I don't remember what get financing is. Mm. Oh, right. That's where I pick up money from Majima. That's right. Duh. Mm. 100 million? Yeah, we can do that. If so, we'll get this money and buy this our 10% commission. Yep. I don't know what it takes in order to do it again. But. How are we doing? Okay. Not quite. Uh, game? Game. Holy game. What are we doing? Alright, we'll go do that side story that we know is over here somewhere. You don't know me. You know this money. Give me an item. There it is. 
An automatic pistol. Okay. All right. What? No, no, no. Yeah, just, just do the money. Thank you. I'll take this. All right, Creeper. We need to talk. Is it her? Or not? I can't tell. Hey. What are you up to? Huh? Who are you? You startled me. Who I am doesn't matter. What do you think you're doing spying on that girl? You better not be stalking her. Well, stalking her? Uh -huh. Oh! No, 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 no. Nothing of the sort. I was just keeping an eye on the girl out of uh, paternal instinct. Paternal instinct? Oh, is she your daughter? Mm. Uh, well, that's where things get murky. I can't really be sure whether she's my daughter or not. What the fuck? Mm. What do you mean? Got it. So I haven't seen your daughter in years. Hey. Yeah. It's been 15 years since my divorce, and more of my visitation rights were denied. That's a long time. Why did you get divorced? Ugh, I hate to admit it, but the business I was running back then went under. The company was doing well, nothing spectacular. I provided a steady income, but I got complacent, failed to see the market turning. When losses started to mount, I kept plowing borrowed money into the failing business. Convinced I could turn around. Eventually, I found myself drowning in debt. My wife must have had enough of my obstinate pride, and she walked out with her daughter, not sue me. I see. After that, I did anything I could to redeem myself. Took every job available and bowed before anyone who would help. Thankfully, the booming economy lifted my fortunes. Now I earn enough money to live without any worry or want. That's good to hear. They saw me now. My wife and not Sumi might be willing to give me another chance. But I have no way to contact them. Then, recently, I found a girl who's the spitting image of not Sumi when she was a child. Just grown up. I see. So she's the hostess you are watching. Yeah, exactly. Fifteen years ago, not Sumi was five years old, so she'd be around that girl's age now. It's not too late. I want to see my girl, not Sumi, again. I want to talk with her and eat together like we used to. I want to be called Daddy again. Hmm. The problem is, I'm not sure if she really is not to be or not. My doubt's keeping me from taking the next step. The girl who might be your daughter is a hostess, isn't she? Why don't you just go to the club and ask her in person? If it were that easy, I wouldn't be suffering like this. Whether that girl's my daughter or a stranger, I need to be emotionally prepared for the fallout. I can't do anything until I know for certain. Well, you never meet your daughter by doing nothing. I was hoping you could help with that. Can you go to her club and figure out whether or not she's my daughter? Me? Yeah. yeah. You understand the situation. And you look to be a man familiar with these kinds of, uh... Nighttime establishments. Uh, of course, I'll foot the club charges. Just do it as a free night out. Mm. Well... Please. Please help me see my daughter. Not even sure if she's really his daughter, but he is hurting and he's willing to pay for it. What should I do? You accept the quest. Uh. Fine, I'll do it. I'll check if she's your daughter or not. <laughs> you will. Oh, thank you so much. Uh, Kiryu. Ah, Kiryu san. My name is Misumi. Thanks again for your help. Please accept this. 10,000 yen. Pocket change. The girl who looks like my daughter uses the name Rika at the club. Please use that money to request her. Uh. Okay. Got it. Thank you so much for doing this. Considering the name of this quest, I'm not so sure that's his, his daughter. And I'm not so sure that he's really looking for his daughter. Welcome. Would you like to request a particular hostess? Uh. Yep. A girl called named Rika? Rika san. Is it? I'll let her know. Hello. It's nice to meet you. <laughs> I 
I'm Rika. Thank you for coming today. Uh. Sure. So, this is the girl who might be Misumi's daughter. Close up. She does kind of resemble Misumi. Um, I'm sorry, but have we met before? Uh. Oh. No. This is the first time. My name's Kiryu. Oh. Well, that's a relief. Please don't scare me like that, Kiryu-san. What's a relief? I didn't remember seeing your face, and, you know, you kind of got a bruise, so... thought maybe you might have been a, a rough sort. I get nervous because I thought maybe I forgot a returning guest's face. Oh, no, that's that's fine. We've never met. Mm -hmm. But then, why did you request me? Nani. Oh? Oh, uh... You asked me by name, so it mean you knew about me, right? Where did you hear about me? Why did you request me? Hmm. She's not going to let this go. I had to avoid making her suspicious. I can't tell her someone who might be her father asked me to come talk to her. What should I say? Uh, I heard about you from a friend, obviously. He told me there's a real cute and charming girl named Rika at this club. Oh! Oh, I see. It makes me so happy to hear that. Who's your friend? I better be extra nice when he comes again. Who? Uh, uh, he was, uh, he was part of a group. There were a lot of guys talking about Rika and how amazing she is. <laughs> oh, yes. Go me. Guess I've got a reputation to live up to. Good. Rika's feeling more motivated. We have to think about it. it. Doesn't really help me at all. Rika, how long have you been doing this kind of work? Um, well, not very long. I started after I turned 20 this last summer, so it would be around six months? 20, huh? Mr. Musada Natsumi should be around 20 years old, too. Does this girl really be the one? Can you, son? What line of work are you in? Oh, I'm currently working in debt collection and real estate. Oh, well, you're quite versatile. Speaking of real estate, you know, I'm thinking of moving. Maybe I could ask you for advice. You want to move? Yeah, my room is too small. I'm not going to use to find out what more about her. Uh... Sure, do you have any roommates? Or do you live alone? Oh, there's two of us. I live with my mother. Oh, you and your mother. How nice. We've been in the same one-room apartment since I was a kid. I'm an adult now, and, well, the room is too small for the two of us. That's why we're considering a bigger place. I get it. I live in a one-room apartment, too. It would be stifling for two people to be cooped up in there, though. That's how it is with us. If there's a good place up for rent nearby, would you let me know? Uh. Sure, I will. She's lived with her mother since childhood. Maybe, just maybe, she could really be the one. I can get one more piece of evidence that points to Rika being Masumi's daughter. Uh, your father's not around? I'm not sure if I should even be asking this, but I take it your father's not around. My father? And to be honest, I don't remember him very well. You don't? No. My parents divorced when I was still small. My mother left him and took me with her. I never saw my mo I have never saw my father since. I can't even remember what he looked like. What caused their divorce? I think my father's business failed. I heard he was in a lot of debt too. The divorce over her father's debt. That matches Masumi's story. How long ago was that? How old were you? Um, I was five at the time, so I, I guess 15 years ago? Five years old. 15 years ago. That settles it. Rika is Masumi's daughter. She's not Sumi. Um, Kiryu-san, why are you asking me these things? Here, let's lighten up the mood. Rika, there's someone I need you to meet. What? Who? Uh. Your father. But my father? But how? Would you come with me? Just trust me. Okay. Listen, I would not be saying okay to that. I would be like, strange man comes in, asks me a lot of first questions, says, here, I want you to come with me to meet your father. It's like, uh, nah, that's, that is very sketchy. Bring him inside. Don't take her out. My father is really here in Kamarocho? Yeah. He's been hoping to see you for a long time. So, where is he? Uh, he should be somewhere around here. Oh, there he is! Oi. 
Hey, about your daughter. Kill you, son. Is my daughter really there? Oh, yeah. Let her see your face. Father? I... I can't. I can't see my daughter. What? Dude, come on! I'm too ashamed to face her. I'm sorry, Kiryu-san. I do ask you to help me, and you even brought my daughter to me. But I can't. Father, it's okay. It doesn't matter anymore. Please. I don't remember very much, so, but let's just talk like we used to when I was little. Raiki had to beg to leave the club for this. You owe it to her to at least get her to at least let her get a good look at you. Here, you son. I was refusing to face reality again. I'm just like 15 years, years ago when I tried to blind out of my business this doom, stake of the debt, and paid for it with my family. I'm not going to run anymore. I'm going to face reality. I'm going to see my daughter. Hello, not to me. Oh, oh no. She's going to be like, wait, that's not my name, isn't she? Oh, no. Who's Natsumi? Nani? Uh... Oh, no. Um, you're Natsumi, aren't you? My daughter. No, I'm Raika. Pardon? Is it Raika's the stage name you used at the club? Uh. No, it's my real name. I didn't want to put up a false front, even for work. What? what? So that means you're not my do- Well then- But you just- Total stranger. <sighs> God damn it. Wow, our backgrounds are so similar, Mitsumi-chan. Someone like Fate or something that we met. Right? Strange, but true. Rekka-chan, you look just like my daughter. I see her in you. What she looked like when she was five isn't anything to go on, though, Mitsumi-san. You're so silly. I couldn't find my own daughter. But I got to know you, Rekka-chan. This is even better. This is so creepy. Hey, Mitsumi. Is this what you wanted? Oh, no worries, Kiryu-san. What's life if you can't enjoy it? Oh, this is for the trouble they put you through. Goddess of Children Amulet? What? Oh, waiter! I bring the most expensive drink you had to Raikachan over here. Thank you, Misumi-chan-san. Oh, stop it. I forbid you to call me anything so formal as Misumi-san. Nope! No, 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 no. I draw the line. I draw the fucking line. God. Oh, I'll call you whatever you like. But I won't. Say it again, please, once more. This is so creepy! Here's the fruit platter, quick. There's more than one kind of father, I guess. I don't like that word. I really don't. You're glad I'm catching up on this game's humor? I'm glad you're glad. God, I'm gonna go check my money. Ah. Uh... Media King, I wanna fight you. Please. I don't know what to do in between the next, um, the next money collection. G give me something to do in between the next money collection. Either, either some place to go trigger a sub story or like a dart or a, or a thing. Don't make me disco. That's my, that's, don't make me disco. Don't make me go to the telephone club. Those are my two requests. Oh God. Ugh. Oh, and we can't mahjong yet. We got it. We got it. That has to be set time set aside for that. So it's three requests. Oh wait, give me an item. G give me this. 
Oh! I can't carry anymore. I'll heal then. Oh, I just... Okay, there we go. Wow, that was a full shot. I need to drop some items off. Jeez. There should be something around Champion District. All right. All right, what are they? Let's drink the alcohol. All right, give me an item. I have so much tour in there. Jesus. We need one more. Oh, we gotta replace the officer. We'll do Namiya. We're gonna change out Suneo. Guess nugget. All right, let's go to the camping district and see what the hell is there. It's a bit of a run to get there. Our item box is really full. Or not our item box, but our inventory is really full. But when we go to fight um, the finance king. And then we're probably also going to have to fight its boss. That'll take care of a lot of our healing stuff, so. Let's do the champion district. I kind of want to check this little spot. Oh. Oh. I made him drop this. A mysterious. Sir I have no idea what I just did to that guy, but I jabbed him with a syringe. Get the fuck up, asshole. Oh, 
Well, while I'm over here. Oh. I can't do these stream machines. That's very sad. Okay, what else is. No. No. Fuck off. This looks like something. Ugh. It hurts. Somebody. Are you okay? I not feel good. Please. She's hurt. Can't even speak properly. What should I hand over? Uh. Here, I have a Torner Plus. I have so many. Here, take this. Oh, I feel much better. Thank you. What happened to you? It happened a little while ago. I lose my yob. Your... your yob? Yeah, my yob. My yob for money. Oh. Oh, you mean your job! It's... it's job, not yob. My yob... job. I work the sexy job, but I no take it anymore. I run away from sexy job, but owner, he catch me and... He roughed you up? He take my passport. I no have passport now. If the immigration find me now, I get kicked out Japan. Then I no can send money to family back home. Passport? I'm just gonna assume you mean passport. Yeah, passport. Some Japanese easy to say, some not. I practice, but this the hard speak. She does seem to have a problem pronouncing words with P sounds in them. I need Biza. Biza? <laughs> yes, Biza. I have the Biza. I work good. I be happy. I'm not sure what you mean by Biza. <sighs> I know how the Biza. Without the Biza, I in trouble. Need the Biza. But no can get the Biza. It's so bad. Mm. I get that she wants a Biza, but what the heck is it? I mean, it's obviously not a peep, so I know I wish it was. Well, if she's having trouble with the way the P sounds, that would mean Biza would be... Does she mean pizza? No, no, Carrie, she doesn't mean pizza. No. Biza, pizza, that's be it. The Biza she wants must be a pizza. Are you ready for a pizza ad? Man... But I, I now I'm gonna be hungry. She's been saying it over and over. She must have her mind set on the stuff. Yeah, I guess I can see how that would make you happy. Yes, everyone happy with the pizza. I want to be happy too. I get the pizza. I work job. No pizza, no job. Family no eat. Weird. Why don't she need a pizza in order to work? Mm. She really must love pizza. Maybe eating the stuff gives her the energy to get back to work. That's some pizza passion right there. You know where I get the pizza? Do I know where to get it? Sure, I think so. Ooh, really? You know? Where? Don't they sell them around here? I heard they're even starting to deliver them right to your house. That's true. This country is so advanced. I want to ask your assist. You get me the pizza? What? Me? Need the pizza. Pizza cost money. I no got money. No money, no biza. I think you get it other way. Please, you get the biza for me? Mm. Easy for you to say. I was hurt and fallen. Nobody come. You only one. And all of Japan. You only nice man. No one else. You only one I can ask. Please, you get me the biza? Sure. This girl can work again if she eats some pizza. Alright, if that's all it takes, why not help her out? Okay, I'll see what I can do. You do it for me. Thank you very much. Then I work. Then I be happy. I had Biza once. Now my Biza time gone. No more left. Well, I guess you do have to get, th to get through it before it goes bad. Sorry, I got no money for Biza. You take this, please. Secret wall. Another secret wallet. Okay. All oh, right. I never saw what the goddess Tony name does. Reduce the number of enemies crowding around you. Okay. Uh.
Okay, I got this. I'll be back with a hot and fresh one. Yes, I'm so happy. My name, Samantha Thomas. Please get, or please get me the pizza. Uh, sure, I'm Kiryu. You can get on me. Kiryu-san, thank you. Now, where do I find pizza? It's Western food, so maybe a burger joint will carry it? Smile burger might work. Where the hell is Smile Burger? I was hoping it would be close. It is not close. Oh, there it is. No, I want. I want to cut through. Thank you. Guys, listen. Could you beat him up somewhere else? Nope, wasn't him. I do have room in my inventory though, so uh, drop an item. Thank you. Kiryu didn't notice that not only was she having trouble with P's, but she was having trouble with V's. Alright, I'm just gonna move on. Okay, good, it's right there. I just learned about dashing. I didn't know this was an option until just this second when I started pushing buttons to try and figure it out. Great, thanks game. Thank you for teaching me the controls. So happy. Uh, the hungry forward woman Samantha asked me to get her pizza. I might have some here. I'll take a pizza to go. The most popular one. Um, did you say pizza? This is a burger shop. You don't have pizza then? I thought you'd have all sorts of western food. I'm sorry. You might have better luck looking for a pizza at a pizzeria. Mm. Pizzeria, huh? Is there one in Camarocho? Well, you could try pizza la. Pizza. Pizza. Pizza la? You order over the phone and they deliver it right away. It's very convenient. Incredible. Can you call this pizza la person and ask if they can get me a pizza? Pizza la is the name of the pizza place. Not a person. Guess it doesn't matter though, I can call them for you, it's not like I have anything better to do. How about a special combination pizza? A large one is 3,000 yen. Sure. Here's the money. Okay, I'll call Pizza Law now. Uh, we're ordering a pizza, no, we're not even, we're having an employee at a burger shop order a pizza for us to be delivered to the burger shop. Thanks for waiting, here's your Pizza Law order. All they do is make a phone call and they deliver. Wow. Time sure have changed. Just wait till you discover the internet, Kiryu. Uh, please enjoy your pizza while it's fresh and steaming hot. Some food is better cold, but certainly not pizza. It's not bad cold, though. It is better warm, but it's not bad cold. Got it. Thanks. Well, some of it's good cold. I appreciate it. No, no. I was very bored, so it's fine. Uh, enjoy it while it's hot, and next time please also try one of our famous hamburgers. Sure. Okay, I gotta get this pizza to Samantha while it's hot. Better hurry. Oh, God. Oh, God! Oh, this is f fucking rude. I hate this. I hate this so much. But at least there's no combat. Wow, guys. In my way.
Why is the music in tight with Kiryu's footsteps? Alright, it's kinda it's kinda not really in time anymore, because we got bumped into. But it was. Samantha? Kiryu-san! I got you what you asked for! Oh, you did? <laughs> yeah, wasn't easy. After all, it's worthless if it's not fresh and hot. Thank you very much. It's no good if it expires. Mm -hmm. Huh? Did you just get the P sound right? Hi. Yes, for a job. I've been practicing. Now I can pronounce Japanese P and V sound. I see. Good job, Samantha. Thank you so much, so... Uh. Oh, right. Yeah. I wasn't sure what you'd like, so I ordered something safe. It looked really good in the picture. Eh? Oh? Picture? You need my picture? Huh? You have a picture of what you wanted? Sorry, I hope I got it kind of close. Oh, if it's close, it should be good. Kira you, son. You are really nice Japanese. This, this first time a Japanese man so nice to me. <laughs> Good to hear. Kira you san I work hard. Work and work till what you give me today expire. Mm. Huh? Till they expire? I'll probably go bad pretty fast. Yeah. Expire fast? Why? What you mean? Mm. Well, how long could it possibly last? A day, maybe? Mm. A day? Oh, no. Kira you san this is not so good. Don't get me wrong, I'm not an expert like you are, but... Then again, it might be different here in Japan than from your country. I don't know. Oh, I see. Maybe Japan different. Okay, take this, and good luck with your job. Kiryu-san? Nah, you don't have to share it. It's fine. It's all yours. Enjoy! Um... What in the fuck? This pizza. I need visa. What? Mm. But, Samantha, you said you wanted pizza so you could eat your fill and get back to work. No, that's not really what I say. How I work with pizza. Uh-oh. I think I royally screwed up. I thought she wanted pizza, but she was really saying visa. I'm such an idiot. Oh, uh, hey, Samantha, it's time. Mm. Why does he have a ghost of himself under his body? You see this? Uh, who is this? This man, he'd make me do sexy work. I've run away. Daddy. What? Samantha, don't forget, you made me a promise. If you get a visa by the deadline, you get your passport back, and you can leave this job. But if you don't, you promised to work for me for the rest of your life. Um, will you take this? It's a good try. Huh? Why am I now holding a pizza? It's not a visa. There's no one on the planet who'd make that stupid mistake. Oh. Samantha's in trouble. And it's all because of my pizza. Oh, come on, Samantha. Move your ass. Who we'll get you back to work and raking the dough again? Hey. Yes. Boy. Hold it. Uh? What do you want? Sounds like your gig is working foreign girls illegally. And? How does this concern you? Well, I feel kind of responsible for this mix up. So I want you to let Samantha go. What? Now wait. Are you and Samantha? You better not be touching my merchandise. Oh no. There's nothing going on here. There's just a little mistake, that's all. Uh -huh. You call my girl a mistake? Uh, I'm calling you a mistake. 
I'm gonna kick that pizza so far up your ass, you'll taste the pepperoni. That would be impressive. Here, let me help you up. Oh, uh, my fist slipped. Sorry. Uh. This guy's for real. Samantha, you're done taking orders from him. If you want a visa, apply properly like you're supposed to. I'll teach you how, okay? Kira, you son. Hey, Samantha's passport. Give it back to her. You can't. Nani. What? I, uh, uh, Samantha, don't leave me. I have to tell you, really. I, uh, I, I love you. What? I'm so crazy about you. I took your passport so you couldn't leave the parlor. I couldn't see the thought of you going away. I'm so sorry for everything. Just, just don't leave me. If you have it in your heart to forgive me, please marry me. What the fuck? But, marry? You? If you marry me, you can work in Japan without a visa. You can even keep wiring money to your family back home. But, I know want to do more sexy work. Uh, of course not. I wouldn't force my wife to sell her body. Samantha, believe me, I'll find your legit work. I'm begging you, please forgive me and be on my side, please. Don't do it. What do you want to do, Samantha? I can kick his ass for you. This man, he did bad things to me, but he only want, he only one who take in woman like me and give me job. When I'm feeling lonely, he talked to me. Samantha. Back home, my family's still waiting, still hungry. I had to work in Japan, so I will marry him, Kiroyu-san. You think it okay? Absolutely not. Absolutely not. That's for you to decide, I guess. If you think it's for the best, I'm... Listen, I don't know you. Thank you, Kiroyu-san. You. If you even look at Samantha the wrong way again, I will shove my fist so far up your ass, it's gonna come out of your mouth. Make her happy or else. Hi. Uh, yes, yes, sir. Kira, you son, thank you very much. This is my thanks. Security wallet, what is with the. Oh, we all eat Kira, you son's pizza. Together. You're sure? Of course. Okay. Now let's eat it while it's still fresh. <laughs> Good pizzas like a new marriage. Enjoy it while it's hot. God, Samantha, please. Do better. <laughs> okay. We eat. Uh. Yeah. Let's have some. Oh, mm. God. It's hot. Apparently. He was shaking. <laughs> At least at the end of the day, the dumb mistake I made tastes better than a visa, right? Why is he here? Yes, here you son. Your visa is number one in the world. Why are you here? Why are you being a creeper? Okay, uh, we can definitely get our money now because that was a long, long segment. I was hoping to go be able to go check on the money in between, you know, picking up the pizza and delivering it, but then the game was just like, oh, you thought that? Nah, here's a mini game. It's like, oh. Okay. It's a pizza law ad. You know what? Good for them. Good for them. Here's what I want to know, though. Here's what I want to know. Obviously, like, in, in Japanese, I don't think, I'm assuming the word pizza and visa probably aren't that similar. So what was this like? In the Japanese version. That's what I want to know. Because if it was still supposed to be an ad for pizza, they still had to work in the pizza part, but what was the visa part? Nope, take the money. 
Pizza in Japanese is just pizza. Oh, wow. Okay. They. All right. And, and I guess Visa is just Visa, I'm assuming. All right. Well, I think that's going to be a good place to go ahead and end this episode of Yakuza 0. Maybe something cool happened? I don't know. Why don't you tell me what you thought about it in the comments? If you're, if you're into that sort of thing, I guess. But otherwise, uh, we'll see you all in the next one. Bye, everyone.